What is life like now, pain-free? Um, it's, I mean, it's significantly better. I am doing lots of things that, you know, I certainly wouldn't have been doing six months ago from, you know, playing golf and doing escape rooms and spending way more time with friends and family. You seem surprised by that. Doing what? Escape room? rooms. You, n you never heard of them? I this have is... heard of them, but they sound like my worst nightmare. Yeah, well, I love them. Um, Do you? Yeah. So you get locked in a room? Locked in a room with, well, I guess you can do it with anyone, but I've been doing it with friends and, and family and, yeah, try to try to escape within the, the allotted time you're it's given. It's all about the strategy. Yeah, which I like. You know, I would never have done anything like that a few days before a tournament before because my hip would hurt and when I'd finished practicing, I'd want to just sit kind of with my feet up and rest, whereas now I can do all of that stuff pain-free and it's, um, it's nice. At the worst point, how tricky was life for you with the hip? I mean, pe pe people that have had like arthritic hips and stuff would know like how, you know, how difficult it can be and how, I probably didn't realise it at the time, but like how unhappy it can make you as well and how long and kind of tiring some of the days feel. Do you think it ever affected you mentally? Did it affect your mental health? Yeah, it definitely did, but like I was saying at the time, I probably didn't realise it as much because that just kind of became the norm, but yeah, it wasn't living life like I would I would want to. Like I'd finished practicing and literally I just wanted to have my feet up the rest of the day and not do much more. What's it like at home? Because you've got two young kids. Before the surgery, were you able to kind of to engage as much as you wanted to with them? Well, I was still able to engage with them. It was just it was just it was more tiring and also it was it was harder to, to enjoy it, like when we go to like soft play places and stuff and I had to get down on my knees and like crawl through tunnels and stuff, it was like so uncomfortable, um, <laughs> but I had to do it, you know, I obviously, I, you know, wanted to do it to spend, spend time and have fun with the kids, but I like going down slides and stuff and climbing up things and um, yeah, I'm, I don't jump into the ball pit so, so much. It's great to see you back. Are you surprised? to see yourself here. Are you surprised to be here at this point? Yeah, a little bit surprised. Um, you know, I got back on the court and practicing again, you know, and I spoke to my team. We thought that, you know, maybe playing some doubles originally would be a good way of kind of preparing me for singles and also testing my, my hip to see what it's like in a match situation where there's obviously not as much movement. Do you feel the love? Yeah, I, I do, and especially when I play you know, when I play um, at home, I mean, support's always been brilliant here and yeah, hopefully when, when we get out on the court here, it'll be, be the same again.